Have you seen this visually breathtaking new game that you can play on your smartphone? Or do you want to know the best way to save battery life on your smartphone? Well, let me show you both of these two things with the top apps of this month. So we all know that battery drain is a huge problem when it comes to our smartphones, especially when we're talking about Androids. And a lot of the times people miss the fact that background apps really do kill your battery life, especially the ones that you don't use. So now with this app called Icebox, we now have the functionality to force stop any app that you want when you turn off your phone and it doesn't require root. And this is something that I do manually all the time for years now. So if you don't know, you can go into developer settings, go into running services, and you can see all the apps running consistently in your background, taking up CPU power and battery. So this app doesn't require root, but it does require ADB debugging, which you can achieve through the Shizuku app. So if you want a quick tutorial on how to enable Shizuku wirelessly on your phone, that video will be linked down below. And once you do that, enable all the permissions through the app and there you go. This is an app freezer. Essentially what it does is every time you turn your screen off, it disables any app that is within the app list and it kills it completely until you launch it again within the Icebox app. So it will be good to use this app for things like Facebook because that app and Instagram takes up a ton of battery in the background because it's always running. But if you use things like Facebook Marketplace, then you may not want to fully uninstall the app every time you want to use it. So right here, I'm going to do an example with the translator app because this might be something that it runs in the background, but this is just going to be a test so that you see that it is fully installed on the phone. But when I go click it in the Icebox app and then go back to my app list, you'll see that the translator is not there and you will also see that it is not running in the background. On newer Pixel phones, you do get an app archive settings and on some other phones, you do get that archive setting, but there are various Androids out there that don't have the app archive yet. And this is a pro level app that gives you that functionality. Okay, so once I saw the graphics for this game, I was in complete disbelief. This game is called Where Wind Meets. And it's probably the best mobile game that I've ever played other than Call of Duty, of course. So the gameplay is kind of like the ghost of Hiroshima. And as you see, the graphics are just incredible. It looks like a console game, even though this is fully on mobile. This game has incredible combat. And if you like to explore, this game is also good for you as well. The exploration is very vast. You will never get bored and there are a ton of different things to do. This is not only a mobile game, but you can play it on console and PC. And your progression does sync between accounts on the PC, console and mobile. So nowadays, pretty much everybody has very powerful smartphone chips, but we rarely utilize them. And this game fully checks all the boxes. Great replayability and the graphics are just incredible. So if you like your privacy, then you need to check out this web browser called UPX. By default, this browser runs on a automatic VPN, so it will hide your IP address and also hide your metadata. So with this browser, you can unlock geo-locked websites to get content that you usually normally wouldn't be able to access in your region. This browser also has many other features like instant blocking for JavaScript and cookies. And one of my favorite things about this browser is that it looks just like Google Chrome, but way more secure. So if you really enjoy your privacy, then it is a must that you check this great web browser out. So if you're like me and you frequently scour the internet for great tech products, but don't you hate when you buy something and then later on figure out that you could have got it on sale on another website? Well, with this next product, it is built to scour the internet for you and find the best deals on your favorite tech products through consumer sites like Amazon and eBay. It is called Price Fox, and it is an extension plugin for your web browser. It works in the background while you browse online. Instead of opening multiple tabs to compare prices, Price Fox scans other retailers in real time and shows you where the same product might be cheaper. So to shop smarter, check PriceFox before you pay. Once installed, PriceFox activates when you visit a product page and it pulls up pricing details from multiple stores and highlights available deals, discounts, and lower priced alternatives. You can also check price drops, which is especially useful for expensive electronics like headphones, monitors, and smartphones. The biggest advantage here is the convenience. So you don't have to rely on just one store or wait for a sale. Price Fox helps you to catch discounts you might have otherwise missed. For tech buyers who care about value, that can mean real savings over time. Download the Price Fox extension available on Chrome and Safari. Check Price Fox before you pay. 
So I know that these top 10 videos are usually about tech related nerdy applications, but I did just want to let you guys know about some cost savings food applications as well. So with this app called Too Good To Go, it allows you to pay about one third of the price of any specific meal that you would like at many different restaurants. So how this app works is that at the end of the day, restaurants and stores have certain foods that they would like to get rid of so that they do not go bad. And with this app, stores create bags of different foods or items that they then put on the app at a discounted price. Most likely one third of the original price for those specific food products. And the bags are first come first serve. So for the good restaurants, you have to make sure to check this app frequently to make sure you get those deals. So for instance, I did one for Shipley's about one month ago and I got about $21 worth of donuts for $6.99. And those donuts did last me for the rest of the week. So if you like extra savings, especially on your food products, then check out this app. Also, another thing that I found that saved me a lot of money on food is just downloading all of the fast food applications that you like to go to or the ones that are close to your house. And within these apps, all of them have daily offers and sometimes they are really good. So like a lot of the times, Whataburger would have an offer saying that if you buy a medium fry with a medium drink, you do get some free chicken or a free burger. So you'll be getting a full meal for around $5. And also Subway a couple months ago was running a month long promotion for if you buy a foot long, you get another foot long free. And you know that foot longs are 11 to $12. So if you're getting two for one, you're paying about $6 per foot long. So I would advise to just go ahead and download these fast food restaurant apps. So whenever you're hungry and you're looking to go get some food, check all the apps and see which one is having a good promotion and use that just to save some money. And if you would like to log in to earn points, I would create a spam email so that they won't be sending you all those annoying advertisements. And there will be a little bit less info tracking if you're using that, that spam email. And if you don't want to download the apps, you can also just create a login and log in through the web browser as well, just so that you can get these coupon codes and these deals. Have you ever wondered how to get gifts on your home screen as widgets? Well, you can do just that with this one app called Magic Widget. So with this app, it offers tons of different unique style widgets, whether you want something very advanced or if you want something plain and minimal. This app is great for both. Also, it comes with some great wallpapers so that you can match up these great widgets with it. And of course, if you wanted to create a gift, you can use this app so that you can put any gift that you want on your home screen. And you can download gifts from the internet or from YouTube and this app will recognize it and give you the foundation to put the gift widget on your home screen. So if this intrigues you, then make sure to download this app or even if it don't, it's just good to know that you could do it. All right, so that's it for this video. I will be making monthly top app videos. So subscribe if you want to see that. And if you want to see five reasons why the Galaxy S25 Ultra is better than the Pixel 10 Pro XL, then click this video right here and I will talk to you guys next time.